Today, I'm going to be bringing you fun facts about dinosaurs. Even though humans haven't ever seen dinosaurs, we're very fascinated with them. You see little boys running around with their little plastic dinosaurs. In museums, you see skeletons, grand skeletons mounted on display for everyone to look at. But actually, scientists have only discovered dinosaurs for about the last hundred years. Dinosaurs lived a long time ago. So naturally, people have been finding dinosaur fossils for years. But people didn't really understand what they were for a while. They didn't know where they came from. So the first scientifically described dinosaur fossil was described by William Buckland in 1824. In China, they refer to dinosaurs as dragons. And it's actually quite common in oriental medicine that dinosaur bones are ground up and they call that dragon powder. A stegosaurus is one of the larger breeds of dinosaurs. So large that when they found a complete skeleton of a stegosaurus in the Colorado Rocky Mountains, they had to remove it by use of helicopter. So just how fast were dinosaurs? They're pretty big creatures, so you'd think that they probably move pretty slow, right? Well, scientists found tracks left by dinosaurs, and by doing calculations, they found out that dinosaurs could reach up to 25 miles per hour. So dinosaurs are extinct, right? That's it. Well, here's something that's pretty crazy. About 10,000 living species of birds have been classified as dinosaurs. So how did the dinosaurs become extinct? Was it a global flood? Was it an ice age? What was it? Well, there's a lot of theories for this. The most popular being that an asteroid impacted Earth and caused a thick layer of iridium to block out the rays of the sun. So the plants died and the dinosaurs were not able to get the nutrition that they needed. Eventually, they died off. Well, what evidence do we have for this? Well, scientists have found traces of iridium all around the world, and it's even believed that the impact place was in Mexico. Dinosaurs still living today? Scientists have found a close relationship between birds and dinosaurs. So close that in fact, many scientists believe that birds and dinosaurs should be in the same biological class. The biggest dinosaur. That's a pretty tough one. There's a lot of contenders for this one. The biggest known dinosaur was the sauropod. Now, the sauropod is one of those four-legged, long-necked, uh, plant-eating dinosaurs. And they lived about the end of the Jurassic to beginning of the Cretaceous. Uh, period, so a long time ago. <laughs> so when exactly did dinosaurs exist? Dinosaurs came about during the Triassic period, which was about 200 million years ago. They ruled the entire Jurassic period and about 65 million years ago in the Cretaceous period, that's when they became extinct. So I bet you've seen the movie Jurassic Park, probably the whole series, now, dinosaurs are depicted in those movies as being scary, meat-eating giants. Well, actually, 65% of dinosaurs were herbivores, meaning that they only ate plants. In 1902, the largest known meat-eating dinosaur was the Tyrannosaurus rex. Now, the way that they found out about this creature was they found a partial skeleton in Wyoming and also in Montana. So the paleontologist Henry Fairfield Osborne drew up the first sketches of the Tyrannosaurus rex. Tyrannosaurus rex means king of the tyrant reptiles. In a future video, facts about the Holocaust. I'm sure you've heard a lot about it in school and in other places, but what's truth and what's fiction? And in a future video, facts about the Aztecs and human sacrifices. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe and let me know what you think. If you have any questions or comments, don't be afraid to leave them. 
please rate the video, let me know if you liked it. The magic crystal ball is sending me a message. It says, click the yellow button and subscribe. Now the biggest dinosaur. That's a pretty interesting question. Dinosaurs, or scientists. Why do I keep confusing dinosaurs and scientists? So how do we know that, sci that scientists even existed? How do we know scientists existed? Now these fossils contain bones and potty, body, potty parts, potty parts.